take me out to the ball game. Take me out. I've been throwing baseball in two years. Had a bad shoulder last summer, but uh, I love baseball and I grew up playing baseball, so I'm hoping uh, we can throw uh, close to a strike. And we definitely don't want a Danny Heatley the ball today. It's uh, the San Francisco game. Uh, threw it right into the ground. Oh, but for the first pitch, how am I going to do, you think? Oh, I think you're going to do fabulous. Yeah? You just look like the kind of guy that's going to do fabulous. I like your attitude. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> All right. Beauty. Let's roll. All right. You're not coming with us? No. Right. We almost didn't throw out the first pitch because I gave away gave my ticket to a fan outside. That's all right. All right, here we go. It's time to go to field level. How are you doing, sir? Good. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, too. Very good, very good. I don't know if they want me to throw BP or not. You guys want me to throw BP? I'm getting caged in right now, apparently. This will be my cage for the next little bit. Oh, beautiful. That's awesome, thank you very much. All right. All right, that's nice. A little hooky from school today? Nice, nice. Is it okay to go on the mound? Yeah. I'm not gonna. So we can throw the fastball. Or the Two seam, four seam. Now we're debating if I should throw a knuckleball or not. Has anyone ever thrown a knuckleball for the first pitch? I don't believe so. You might think be I should, should I try to risk it and do it? Just try it. It might, it might work out good. See, I'm just worried that it could be a bounce if I throw a knuckleball. You won't be the first to bounce it. Well, I know that. That's <laughs> very true. Very true. Well, well, has anyone ever thrown a knuckleball as the first pitch? I don't think so. We're going to need verification. Has anyone ever thrown a knuckleball for a first pitch? I can't confirm or deny that. Can you call someone? I need someone at first just in case I'm going to pick, pick someone off first place. Uh, I wonder if this Huff guy is uh, one in five. I guess I'm not getting too many tips from him about the pitch. Let's see if there's any girls around. Oh, okay. Zoom in more, you see him better. How does Wakefield throw this all the time? Hey, what's going on, buddy? How are you? I'm thinking of throwing a knuckleball. <laughs> Should I throw it? I mean, that's what can happen with a knuckleball. That's the problem. A lot of people think this is a bad idea. Oh, no, it's a great idea. That's what I thought. Birthday? You know what? I'm going to throw a knuckleball for your birthday. Just for your birthday, I'm throwing a knuckleball. How'd you get out of school today? I had a doctor's appointment. Yeah, yeah, me too. Me oh, too, really? yeah. Oh, yeah. That's why I got it. Uh, got me out of school today. Did you throw the first pitch or something? Yeah, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, let's throw. So what should I throw? Fastball, curveball, um, or slider? Throw a knuckleball. That's what we're talking about. Now, fans, please direct your attention to the field for this afternoon's ceremonial first pitch. He played in a career high 74 games last season and played in his 100th career game on March 2nd versus Philadelphia. Finishing the season fourth on the team in hits with 109 and won 288 of 462 faceoffs taken. Good for second on the team. Please welcome from the Tampa Bay Lightning, Zenon Kanapka. All right, Zenon. It's All right, buddy. Finish. That was pretty good. That wasn't bad. Hey, that wasn't a bad knuckleball. Where's that pitcher coach? If the pitcher coach would work with me. All right. See that knuckleball? I don't think people thought it knew it was knuckleball. So I guess me and Tim Wakefield are the only guys throwing a knuckleball these days. Another can of corn. I predicted uh, David Price to throw a five hitter today. So uh, we'll see how, see how that works. So Zenon, we talked hockey, let's talk baseball. You threw out the first pitch today, tell us about it. Well, it's pretty exciting to uh, obviously come to the race game, throw out the first pitch, and uh, I'm buddies with a couple of players uh, on the race team. So uh, 
they were kind of giving me some instructions. Uh, Upton and Longoria were pretty adamant about just not bouncing the ball into into the into the catcher's mitt. You didn't bounce it. And uh, I, I came up with the idea of throwing a knuckleball. Uh, for what reason, I, I don't think anyone's ever thrown a knuckleball for the first pitch. I thought it would be uh, pretty cool. And Longoria really didn't think uh, I could make it to home plate uh, with a knuckleball, but uh, it was a little high and outside, but it got to the plate. Just a little bit, right? Just hey, well, you use your knuckles in hockey, and so you use your knuckles in baseball, too. It's all good. That's right. Now my hand's pretty sore after throwing. <laughs> so I, we were warming up before throwing knuckleballs, so uh, you know, I'll have to put the, ice, uh, put, put the hand back in ice just like the season. All right, Z-Man, we'll see if the Rays can get ahead here. Thanks for joining us. Yes, thanks. All right, here we go. That's my boy. Day at the ballpark, uh, got to throw at the first pitch, which was a knuckleball. Uh, made it to the plate, didn't bounce the ball. That was great. And uh, now we're working on uh, the Rays winning this game, and everyone goes home happy. So uh, it's been awesome, and uh, the players and uh, management were great to me. And uh, you know, uh, next time I might bring a hockey stick to shoot the ball in for the first pitch, but uh, for now I think that's a wrap. And uh, We'll watch the end of, watch the end of the game and uh, cheer the Rays on. Oh, game.